This island is an extraordinary place. I meet people and I spend my time with people who are inspiring, who are energized, who are energetic. <laughs> Green Ambassadors is a three-year sequence. They're 15 to 18 years old. It's a partnership we do uh, with the National Park Service, which views Green Ambassadors as a youth uh, conservation corps program. They're working not just on Thompson Island, but around the entire Boston Harbor Islands park and ecosystem. Their actual work focuses on land management, so they're doing trail building and maintenance, invasive plant removal, facilities management, which mostly looks like carpentry. And so they've built everything from wildlife observation platforms to benches to right behind us are compost bins they're working on. On this project right here, what we're making right now is compost bins. And right here is our 12 feet by four compost bin. And we really want to make compost bins because we take a lot of trash off this island and we want to lower that down. And if you compost, you could get soil. And right here next to it, we try and make this a little farm slash plant. And we're going to use the compost, the soil, to make the plants. And it offended the green ambassadors when they were boarding and unboarding our boats to and from the island that they were bringing quite so many trash bins full of all kinds of plastic and recycling things, kitchen waste, food waste. And they said, this is not the way it ought to be. And so this is them bringing to us their knowledge and their understanding of environmental stewardship and the futures they face. And they're the ones who brought us and organized our recycling program that went into effect last year. A couple years ago, we were talking about recycling. And we didn't have no recycling on the island. And another year three group, group said, we should have recycling. And then next year, they brought recycling to the island. And I feel like GA right here, if the year three say something, it might happen. We just have to speak up. We've done studies and we've asked them about what it feels like to board the boat in the city. And, and, and after this short boat ride, they're out here in this radically different place. Many of them haven't sort of mucked around in the water and mucked around on a seashore or worn a tool belt and created something. And they do projects in school and there are Boston public school teachers doing really, really impressive and important things with them. But out here, there's the opportunity to expand it. The reason why I go for this is because it's like away from the city and name a person that come on the island every single day to go to work. It's like one out of a hundred people do that, right? That's why I would choose this job. There's a lot of talk here about the way we serve uh, our green ambassadors and the students we work with and there's no question that that's a two-way street and they serve us and, and their futures and, and the city's future uh, incredibly admirably. Mm -hmm.